Hello everybody, I'm Zachary Wolven, or Fowler out of the you know. Today I'll be doing a review on one of my favorite books. Rainbow Six. Rainbow Six. You're probably asking, why? Why? What? Why? why? Because it's the book that I And no, not the video game Rainbow Six. The book Rainbow Six. But anyway, on to the content. The story goes, these guys from America go to Britain, they make this quote, covered up team to fight terrorists. They fight terrorists, they wonder why there's so many terrorists. All this conspiracy crap is going on, it's just getting all weird. So basically, a standard terror story. So you've got the good guys on one end, and all that shooting terrorists up. You got the terrorists on one side, and pee pee pee, we don't kill all these people. Yeah, uh, yeah. You get to see both sides of the story. It's kind of like the yin yang symbol, except for it's not really like the yin yang symbol because the yin yang symbol really doesn't speak. And yeah. So there's the first mission where they're all just they walk in. It's the first stuff. They don't know really what to do. The terrorists are taking over the bank. The hostage gets killed before they get there, then they go in, they, they shoot all the terrorists. It's a good mission, right? But then you see the bad guy, Mr. Paulfos, his position, I guess. He's sitting there like, oh, oh, hey, that was stupid. And so then he goes back, he steals all the terrorists' money, goes and steals the bank's money, has, has a good time. The good guys don't even know when they're drinking their beers because adults do that crap. So yeah, you learn a little more about the characters, you learn all this crap. Then the next mission comes in, where they have to go save these people again. They have to go save a rich boy from his imminent demise. How original. I don't know if one of us wrong here. I love the book. It's just I hate the fact that they have to go save this rich boy from some stupid terrorists who think that all the businesses are bound together somehow and they need money. Money. All know money rules everything. So yeah, that's basically how the, the first two missions go. The rest of the mission is the same. The story continues. You learn a little more in this conspiracy thing about the Shiva virus. Of course, there's the whole fact that there's no grammar. It's very easy to read. Yeah, it's a good book overall. I love it. I know you will too. Everybody does. No, they don't. So on a scale of 1 to 10, I give this book an 8. So that's all the time I have for this video. Uh, I don't know. Like, subscribe. Wait for me to make another video if that ever happens. See ya.